Listing Diario Editorial for October 11th of 2022. Don't play with health. Diabetes, cardiovascular disease, cancer, hypertension, and other high-risk diseases are seriously compromising the health of Dominican people. It seems that in this country, we are playing with health, allowing dangerous practices such as the use of anabolic steroids, illegal drugs, and junk foods to become widespread without control by the authorities. The tendency to a sedentary life, which traps young people addicted to electronic games, poorly fed, and insomniacs advances in parallel to that of those who take extreme exercises in gyms seeking exuberant muscles mass or those who inject non-certified inks to get tattoos, those who inhale harmful substances in vaping, and those who invent the use of insulin and infusions or natural leaf teas as remedies. The Institutes of Diabetes, Cardiology, and Dermatology have been sounding the alarms for some time in the face of this oversized with health. Since year after year, they see how the records of young patients in their consultation rooms increase. Under the COVID pandemic, some 82,167 young people under the age of 20 were infected, of a total of 4,384 deaths until today. 24.6% had signs of high blood pressure and 15.9% of diabetes. Specialists agree that the greatest danger is in anabolics used in pills, injections, gels, or creams, which cause numerous consequences, such as liver or kidney damage, heart damage, masculinization of women, and vice versa. Society, but especially the Ministry of Public Health, should be more concerned about this phenomenon, since it is the generation of the present and the future that is threatened. For Listing Diario, voice over in translations by Indira Rodriguez.